Tell us in the beginning, when you're working the New York comedy club scene, what was the average day for you? Because there are stories of other famous comedians that launched that in New York. It was brutal. Yeah, well, I would say um, for a bunch of years, my average day, I worked in advertising. I uh, initially as an account executive and then a copywriter. Like, I thought they were going to fire me, and then they're like, we're going to make you a copywriter. <laughs> and I had been trying to get laid off for years. <laughs> and they were so nice. But um, so I would say I would get up, hopefully get to work at 9, sometimes much later. And I would work until 5 or 6. I would then go to an acting class from say seven to nine or seven to 10. Then I would go and do stand up on nights that I didn't have an acting class. I would go and do stand up. And then I would probably get home around one. I didn't really have a social life for, I don't know, maybe a decade. You know? It was like one of those, that, but I loved it. But it was absolute insanity. You know, it was, uh, you know, if you if view it as like repeatedly doing something, expecting a different outcome, <laughs> and it's not a different outcome, if that's insanity, then I was definitely 